Hello people, just a quick video here. Uh, I'm gonna change the wheels on my uh, Hopi EV or F F uh, V8 car. It comes with uh, stock uh, 12 millimeter hex. I changed to the aluminium. I think the stock one is plastic. So I, I bought these adapters, they are for going to 12 to 70, 17 millimeter. So I have already mounted them, as you can see here on the rear. Uh, just gonna show how it mounts, it's quite easy. You have the stock uh, 12 millimeter hex here, and you just uh, put them in like this. And uh, yes, uh, these were very tight here, so I, <laughs> I had to file off a bit on the edges on the hex here. You can see I filed a bit of the edge, edges there. And then I can insert them here, so like that. And you have this bolt here that's uh, open in the middle with the treads. So you just put that in here and yes, tight it here. And I'm gonna use some uh, thread glue on it in here this is thread lock glue I just used the blue one so I put the drop in here and then I'm gonna insert it and tight it there and when we have that done I'm gonna do it after I record her but just show you it like this then we could uh, have the stock wheels, uh, but I use 12 mm hex. They got about 80 mm diameter. I have used Louisa wheels on this car with 90 mm diameter. And uh, now I'm gonna put on these Arma D Boots Hoons. They are 100 mm and uh, it's 42 mm in the width. But I got 17 mm hex, so now with this adapter, I can put this wheel on. Let's see, like this. I'm recording a video here. Now I got the wheel on. Now I got the wheel on here and with this 70 mm hex. I'm not gonna tighten it really now, but just to show you. And it's just enough space here. You can see when I turn the wheel there. But these wheels are not ballooning uh, very little at least. So I believe I can still use the car with these wheels and also I also cut off a bit on the body to fit the Louis wheels that was uh, 19 uh, millimeter diameter so you see it's enough cut off the body here so I have the D boots hoons 100 millimeter diameter fitting all right and again I'm gonna be in it's going to be a tight fit, you see here, but it's just enough space. Uh, this uh, 12 to 70 millimeter adapter, they also give you 15 millimeters more width. So they. Uh, the original, the stock hex 12mm is here, you can see a bit of it there, so that goes around into this part, and this adapter will extend the width there with about 15mm, so it will get a bit more out, and you have to have something like that because these, uh, 
Debo's runes, they have no offset really. So that's all. This is the part number for the Arma Ara 550062. That's these wheels. They come two in the pack, so you have to buy two packs. And the adapters are Absima. What is this? Absima with uh, item, item number 2560023. Absima.com. I just bought them uh, in a Norwegian RC shop. But there uh, are many who are selling adapters like this, and you can get some cheap ones from uh, what they called uh, AliExpress or the other Chinese uh, online stores. So now we're gonna mount the wheels and we're gonna look how it uh, look when I'm finished. And then also I have to set up the steering end. and I just uh, uh, end points so the wheels are not hitting into the body. Yep, we'll be back. Yes, I got the uh, D-Boot Zones mounted now on the car. And uh, it look, uh, looks very good. Uh, but I believe this uh, size 100mm is near the absolute limit you can have in the, in the diameter on this uh, car. You see here the uh, steering is really close now. If I turn the wheels you see it's very close to the car here. A bit more on this this corner. Uh, so I have to set the end point so the wheels are about this, something like this I believe. And that is enough uh, turn because you don't take this very, very small turns when racing. Uh, so I believe it will go okay. On the rear it's uh, more to go on here, but that's, uh, they are not turning of course. And if I put on a body, let's see, uh, something like this. You see the wheels are, are close to the body here, and if I press down on the car, the body will hit on the wheels here. So. I will see how that goes. I could maybe stiffen the shocks springs a bit so the car will stay a bit more up. But hmm, I'm not sure. But uh, I believe it's okay only when you hit when the car is jumping or something, it will maybe hit a bit on the wheels. But I believe it will be. All right, so this is the Huapi VR8 with the Arma D-Boots 100mm diameter. So I will see how what speed I get with these wheels and how it is to drive. On-road driving, of course. That's all. Bye-bye.